I am going to tell of you of one of the most fearsome and terrifying of creatures known to man. I am referring, of course, to cows. <laughs> but not just any cows, no. These be polar cows. Sorry. Exactly. <laughs> Out upon the frozen tundra, where the ice and snow allow, there lives a lonely creature. It's the Arctic polar cow. Some have fought it nearly mythic, for they're seldom told of now. But I'm here to give you warning of the Paris polar cow. It's got icicles for otters, all a coat as soft as silk. There's snowshoes on its hooves, and it does produce ice milk. But it's crafty, wise, and cunning, a ferocious fighter, too. The polar bear, he does beware when he hears that dreaded boo! For the polar cow's carnivorous, likes the taste of me and you. To trap its prey, it knows to build a seeming safe igloo. Then it pounces out from hiding, as its victims crawling forth. Eat an Eskimo from head to toe, back the cattle of the north. So beware this baleful bovine, pernicious porter, house of doom. No, do not laugh at the dread, not cap, the dread trails it consume. Stay away from mauling mavericks, for my tails, no bull. I vow <laughs> that most hazardous of heifers, it's the perilous polar cow. Out upon the frozen tundra, where the ice and snow allow, there lives a lonely creature, it's the arctic polar cow. So my thought, the unity thing. For it's seldom told of now, but I'm here to give you warning of the perilous polar cow. So do not cheer the snow, bump steer, but the perilous polar cow. Say moo. 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 <laughs> if I don't move, you think you won't notice me next time? Nope. Ah, damn. <laughs>